Hey everybody, it's Erica coming at you with a small haul today. So this one is going to be for Dollar Tree. Um, I only spent about ten, about nine dollars and some change, and I just bought some staples and a couple. Of, I just bought a few of the staples that we usually have uh, or need in the house. So I got my daughter some of these cheese dip and pretzels. I got her a bath bomb star. I thought this was really pretty. In fact, Dollar Tree actually had a section over where they sell like the hairbrushes and things um, just dedicated to like tweens. I it, it had glitter. It had it looked like something from like Justice, and it had a lot of you know those um, fluffy looking uh, pins, and it had. Um, a lot of different kinds of bath bombs, um, journals, bag tags, all kinds of stuff. It was really cute. And um, you guys might start seeing that in your um, Dollar Trees. And it is just, I, I think it's just very special. So next thing we got is also a staple, but we have not purchased these in a while. And if you've never tried these, um, they are really good. Now, I haven't had anything. I've been eating these for years, and um, they are, they're about, I don't know, they're about three inches, I guess, two and a half. Um, here's, here are the ingredients. Nothing too ridiculous back here, guys. I can at least pronounce everything, and pretty for the most part, I know what everything is. And um, they are made in China. They're distributed um, by the food team, East Brunswick, New Jersey, but they are a product of China. Um, so if you don't like that kind of situation, and I'm sorry, but you know, I've never had an issue with these and they're very easy. I like to cook them in the oven or, you know, like a toaster oven, get them crispy. Um, some energy drinks. I started to kind of drink a cup, uh, drink some of these too. So I had to get my husband some. Um, moon pies and some of this um, Arm & Hammer Fresh Pet Carpet Odor Eliminator. This is actually, I think, a pretty decent deal. I don't know, let me know if you find it cheaper somewhere else, but I mean, for as much as you get in here, I don't find it a bad deal. So the other thing that I got that was little cute and a little weird because I'm not a real big Christmas person like ornament wise but I love my Christmas tree and uh, my setup so I saw these and I had to grab them before they just didn't have them any longer because that's just kind of how the Dollar Tree works of course um so I got this it doesn't actually look too cheesy I think the wreath could use a little filler but um I'm gonna cut some of these like little extra strings off and I think this would be really cute. It is like that cardboard type woody feel. This I thought was absolutely adorable. I love snowmen, I love sleds, and I had to grab this one as well. It's got a little glitter on it. I don't know, I thought that was kind of cute. So that's my Dollar Tree. Uh, there was a couple of other things. Oh, and did I show the moon pies? Hope I did, but um, there were a couple of things there, Halloween-wise, that, um, well, fall-wise. I don't really like Halloween decorations as much as I just love um, just fall. Um, it's almost 90 degrees right now, and it's like 10 o'clock a.m., and I'm in Ohio. So I'm really just looking for some kind of fall somewhere. Somebody help me. Um, so anyways... Uh, let me load up the Aldi and I'll come back to you in just a second. So here's my Aldi. So if you saw my last week's haul, you would know that I spent like 220, 230 bucks. And I went to Trader Joe's, Aldi, and I can't remember the other store off the top of my, oh, Sam's. So I really didn't need anything this week. And that was the goal, not to have to go to the store. But mm, if you've been noticing, I tend to always go to the store. But I only spent $20 at Aldi, and I thought that was a pretty good deal, considering it was just a couple things we needed. Like I said, I started to kind of drink some of these, so I got my husband 
five total, two from the Dollar Tree and then three from Aldi to kind of replenish the 12 that we bought last week so we can make it through next week without having to buy them. Um, these are a good deal. They kind of taste like the Monster, Silver Can Monsters. So they're a buck though. Um, got my dogs some more of these dental sticks. They really enjoyed them. So uh, what I've been doing because they're kind of, they're small dogs, I've been kind of making them and flip, uh, breaking them into threes and then giving them two in the morning, two of the little um, thirds, uh, one each every morning and one each at night. So we've been through, we just finished the first batch and uh, they really enjoy them. So I got them these again. Um, this was something that they don't really sell at Aldi. I do like their cold brew, but it's smaller and um, it was actually more expensive than this. And I like this as well. So I did pick this up. This, these, if you guys have never tried the apple cinnamon straws, I recommend them. They are absolutely delicious. And I had to buy two because these are seasonal and I may buy a case of them. I'm not kidding um, because they are so good. They're not the best for you as pretty much anything that's really delicious. So here's the ingredients. There's all of that. So, but they are very, very delicious. Another thing that's a big staple in our house is the kettle chips mesquite barbecue. They're like $1.29. And guys, these are really, really good quality chips. Um, baking soda, distilled vinegar, ketchup, which is a dollar twenty-nine dollar thirty. And I'm gonna tell you guys, this is good ketchup. 38 ounces, awesome deal. Gala apples. These are the small ones. Good munching apples. Uh, my daughter enjoyed them. My husband enjoyed the ones that we got from Trader Joe's. I especially enjoyed them. So I thought, you know, that'll be the fruit of the week. All right, guys, that was it. That's all I've spent today between the Dollar Tree and the Aldi. 30 bucks. We are good for another week. Um, so thank you so much. And you have an awesome week. Please like and subscribe and share. Give me some suggestions on what kind of videos that you would like to see from me. And again, you guys have a wonderful week. <laughs> Say goodbye, Sam. <laughs>